it's time for a daily dose of victory, even if it's just a minute with the pastor. Hey, I'm Pastor Tony Smith, the pastor of Victorious Ministry. We're on the subject, uh, having a sincere thank you, bringing some, some passion behind it, something that has some substance in it when you use the word thank you. I know that we, in the, the way the economy is today and the way customer service is today, it's very really rarely that you see someone behind the counter that gives you, uh, that knows how to give good customer service. I, I, I hate to say that, but it's really very rare when you find someone like that. But today, I want you to do something different. I want you as a customer to show customer service. I want you to begin to go to McDonald's and go to other stores and the, 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 the lady that doesn't speak good English, as you say, and all these things. And I want you to be kind to them and tell them, thank you for your service. Thank you for being here. Thank you for giving me this. Thank you. Let's try it. Thank you. And be sincere with it. You appreciate them. That when you sit down for lunch, you give a tip. You don't don't just set the tip down on the table. Wait till the uh, the way to come back. Give her the tip in her hand and say thank you. Thank you for serving me. I appreciate it. It might change the epidemic that we have in customer service by you choosing choosing as a customer to show those that are waiting on you that even though you choose to not be excellent in customer service, I choose to be excellent as a customer. Thank you. Hey, I'm Pastor Tony Smith. I pause the program just for a minute to call all ladies June the 10th, Friday night at 12 midnight going into Sunday, Saturday morning. June the 10th, I'm encouraging all women to meet me at Victory Ministries at the Amphitheater on York Road where God will be moving with signs and wonders if you're bound, if you're free. If you just want to move into another dimension of God, I'm calling every woman of the city to come and be a part of that service and God will set you free that day.